Hello, I will talk about my computer setup and my hi-fi system. And here it is on the table and my table is in front of the window and beside my bed. And uh, there is my gym beside my bed which I train on. My room is very small, so I have everything together closely. Let's look at my uh, setup here. Here's my uh, keyboard, uh, my screen, it is a small screen. And my speakers are beside the screen. They fit very good for this table. I would get a better, little better sound if I placed them further apart the speakers but I only use the speakers for for gaming on the computer and movies uh, but my real audio system is uh, using uh, the headphones so I don't need any I don't need any room treatments here because I use headphones so that's uh, the reason I use them and then let's look at the back here. This is uh, my CD player. I'm using um, a Marantz CD player. CD 5005. Uh, and that's a great CD player because it is cheap and better than uh, the, the other CD players I had before which cost uh, $30,000 and this one goes only for $400 so I like it a lot the big uh, uh, the positive thing with this, this CD player is that uh, I can shut off the di digital output at the back which uh, reduces power consumption and gives a better sound. Uh, there's the digital. Uh, there's the digital output. So I shut it off. I get better sound. I use the analog outputs uh, into a heat can amp uh, there, and from that I use. Uh, the headphone cable into the headphones and you see I have many uh, large cables here I will talk about them soon and the the rocks on top of the equipment these are the audiophile rocks I will show the website audiophile rocks and the and the website address is this is the website address audiophile dot rocks and you see here it is the domain name very clever uh, and here are the rocks and the cables which I have and uh, here are the rocks and each rock costs a couple hundred dollars and this uh, I like this a lot because they take the performance level higher than uh, normally that you normally get from uh, cables even so these rocks are better than a cable upgrade and uh, here's a large uh, tweak it comes in pieces so you, you upgrade I have upgraded the tweaks and these I have built these tweaks myself just so you know 
because I will show you an in incomplete cable. There's the incomplete cable. It, uh, the other end has uh, black black crystals on the on the ends there you see. I haven't put them on yet on the other end but it still it still sounds amazing. And this one is called the Orca power cable. It costs many thousand dollars. And there's even a better cable which I use for my amplifier, my headphone amplifier. That one is called the Superstar power cable. Because it is better than the older Star power cable. And my interconnect is Star, Star RCA interconnect there it shines like stars in the universe and it goes uh, to the back of the Marantz CD player the other uh, snake looking uh, cable is a snake RCA cable but it's not as good as the star RCA cable but they are close in performance and uh, the headphone cable is uh, there's the headphone output. Uh, you, it uses the Furutec uh, wiring into into here into this tubing, and inside the tubing is uh, a crystal, crystal many crystals which filters the sound. It is the best filtering in the world inside all of these cables and here you see the filtering it uses many different uh, crystals fine-tuned to 0 0.01 gram accuracy um, and uh, the, I use the best power cables for my headphone system the CD player uses the Orca power Headphone amplifier, the star, the superstar power, and they go into the uh, power strip here. And from the power strip, I use an incomplete cable. Uh, in incomplete, the this big one is the incomplete cable because I haven't filled the tube with anything no filtering here you see and it takes many years to to build all the filtering to to fill up the tube and I will show you the show you the wall it goes the other end goes into the wall there and you see the, the very thick cable, which I will fill with the crystals in the future. So that's my headphone system. Now I will show this, the computer system, which uh, I, I use uh, the cable for that too, but I, I'm not so... Uh, picky about uh, the sound for my computer so I use I use a standard uh, power strip here I will go to the other side I use a standard power strip because I, I can I need to shut off the speakers with this button so that's why I, I use it Otherwise, I would just plug it into my power strip there and use a better power strip because uh, my my speaker button speaker button broke here, so I I can't switch it off. So that's why I use 
the switch of the power strip and from the power strip I use a holy prophet power cable into another power strip and from that one I use a snake power cable into the left speaker I use uh, the cheapest plugs here because I use the best plugs for my headphone system you see the FurTech for the headphone system and the other other cable I use some uh, old uh, plugs from uh, Nordos to Vishnu power cable the Marinko plug it is very very bad but that's all I had and I use an uh, a holy ocean power cable into into my left speaker and uh, there I have a full check plug because I didn't have uh, any more cheap plugs so I had to use that one and then I, I forgot to show uh, the headphone tweak this is the Ice King, Ice King uh, tweak. It is a large rock. It is the best I have now. It is the best tweak in the world. So let's see the computer system here. Uh, I have uh, from that power strip goes uh, the and uh, a cable for the extension strip there a cheap power strip and into that I have plugged in um, an old uh, dolphin uh, dolphin let's see if you can see dolphin power cable I have that plugged into the computer power supply and this cable is old but it is very good for computers because it makes it uh, more lead back and so I don't uh, get a headache because the computer is very noisy and uh, this is the internet uh, modem I have it plugged it into the same one same power strip and inside the computer I have hard drive it is on foam outside the case and this uh, hard drive is plugged in with uh, a night SATA cable the night SATA cable is plugged in into the the computer somewhere I can't turn this camera so good uh, and then let's try, let's open this and see if you can see something else ah here is another hard drive uh, and it is also plugged in with uh, a night SATA cable inside uh, the computer so uh, let's go to the other end, other side of uh, the computer and there you see this, uh, this cable, this is the uh, display cable, uh, DVI display cable and uh, there are crystals inside the large tubing and it goes let's go to back to the other side oh my some crystals fell off the CD player let's put them back I don't want bad sound if some rocks are missing so here uh, the the large the large cable goes 
there and from that uh, the black uh, wire goes into my display so it cleans the noise from the display and then I have uh, let's go to the other side again I'm getting tired from all this running and there I have an adapter which I have plugged into the motherboard audio output and from that I have uh, some old night RCA interconnects this is the 20 millimeter version and this one is the 25 millimeter version and then I have plugged into my uh, speakers so that is uh, 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 here are some decorations on my speaker which I haven't put them there so that is not my doing so that's uh, that's the end of my uh, video where I show my hi-fi system and it, it, it sounds amazing it is the best sound I have ever had uh, what what happened to the tip the tip is missing I need to put back the tip of my on top of my rock there so that's the end of my video I hope you liked it and subscribe uh, for updates in the future of my system Goodbye.